Last month, our Andrew Banstra told you about Emmett Bailey, a.k.a. Mullet Boy, the nine-year-old from Menominee that won the USA Mullet Championship. Well, today, Andrew caught back up with Emmett at Mullets on the Yard. What's better than spending a 75-degree October Saturday at a mullet-inspired charity event? I don't know. Right behind me, they're cutting mullets. Riley's Tavern hosted Mullets on the Yard. A co-owner and relative of Emmett's had to join in on the fun. Every fresh mullet cut today, Bush Light is donating $50 to the Locks of Love. And for any uh, buddy that shows up today that has an existing mullet, uh, they'll donate $20. The tavern partnered with Julie Grace Salon, raising hundreds of dollars for locks of love, even if Chuck's mullet isn't quite what it used to be. Don't have much party in the back these days, but uh, going all business in the front. Emmett's life has changed quite a bit since we last spoke. It's really crazy. Uh, there's been, we've been overwhelmed with how many different places have reached out to Emmett to just have him come and be at their events, like things like this. Um, like you mentioned, he got to throw out a first pitch at a Brewers game. He got to go out on the ice at a uh, Chicago Blackhawks game. He yeah. got, uh, we went to a Badgers game. He got to be on the field at a pregame for a Badgers game. I'm Emmett Bailey and I'm Mullet Boy. And as for Emmett's best Mullet in America trophy, it's not going anywhere anytime soon. Like this. Are you ever going to get rid of that? No. What if somebody Never offered you $10 million? You just do it? No. In Verona, Andrew Banstra, News 3 Now. Well, despite Emmett's best try, Andrew did escape Verona and return to the newsroom with a full head of hair tonight.